Hello Aries, Sun, Moon and Rising. Welcome to your general reading for the month of June. Before I go ahead, I'd like to thank everyone who has subscribed, liked and commented. Um, thank you for all the support you've given to me on my channel. I mean both channels. Thank you very much. And if you're looking for a private reading um, or you want to donate to my channel, um, please look at um, for all the information you want at the about page and i also like to thank everybody who have um, booked a reading with me but those of you who have emailed me um for your private comments you know as you didn't want to share it publicly um thank you very much um this this you know gives me the boost and the encouragement to do more readings for you and today i've pre-shuffled so that you know um it doesn't take too much time to upload because i'm already late in doing your reading so i thought this month this is how i want to do it or today this is how i want to do it so that next time i can shuffle in front of you as i normally do so let's start aries um and this is for aries sun moon and rising yeah so let's begin your reading in first position is the king of pentacles which is still a taurus and aries okay and what is crossing you is the ten of wands I feel this is more crossing you okay in your foundation is the page of Pentacles in your recent past ace of wands and what is coming in your near future is the chariot and what can be achieved in the month of June the Sun card yes okay so as you how you be feeling overall energy is the five of pentacles you got pentacles going on here and affecting your environment i've got two cards for you is the nine of cups and the page of swords okay yeah because this is this reading is not for an individual so a thought is good to take both cards which turned for you or which jumped for you okay and your hopes and fears is the knight of wands and your outcome is the queen of cups okay so what i want us to do it's just go ahead and if I feel we should um, clarify any of the cards then we'll, we'll do that within the reading but if we feel like there's an understanding here then there'll be no need for clarification okay right so in the month of June I feel like you are going to have a lot of responsibilities okay that is how I'm feeling because this is you and this is what is crossing you a lot of work a lot of responsibilities and it is crossing you and your base is the page of Pentacles you know this is your foundation this is going to be your foundation something that will be on your mind constantly would be finances and here you are here holding you know um, thinking about this money as well and this you know for for this to come into fruition you would need to um do a lot of work take a lot of responsibilities on so it, it looks like this month is going to be um a bit of a um, busy month for you yes busy that's how i can see it okay and in your recent past you know this is maybe a project you've already started you know towards the end of may or something and um yes maybe that is why you are feeling that like, you know got a lot of responsibility and thinking that you want this you know money to come in for you that's how i'm feeling you know yeah and what can be achieved is the sun okay so good things are coming for you the hard work is going to pay off the hard work is going to pay off and what is coming in the near future is the chariot 
mean so your hard work this is what can be achieved and this is what's coming okay so yes your hard work is going to pay off because with the chariot is success determination and you're going to be feeling happy so all these responsibilities that you'll be taking on in the month of june aries um yes it's it's going to be good and i also feel like this could be someone who is a sagittarius who might come in your way to help you um to push forward what you need to do you know because as we can see you've got finances on your mind a lot you know you've got finance on your mind a lot so i feel like this is the business you you, you know you 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 want to steer forward and the chariot is here to let you know yes this is possible but you know the ten of wands is telling you that yes you are you are nearly there and success is is here for you that's all i'm seeing because if the sun card says that is what is coming this is what can be achieved it means your hard work with sheer determination is going to give you a success and the happiness you're looking for okay yes 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 so this is how you will be feeling you know but let's not forget let's not forget this is what can be achieved so yes you do have finance on your mind and you are worried about it or you will be worried about it your outcome is going to be the sun card this is something that can be achieved with determination yeah yes so affecting your environment is i also feel like having this guy here this page here would be signing contracts signing contracts with um, someone who could be a pisces or a water sign or someone who could be you know air sign because this is what is affecting your environment and this could be um could also be that it's uh, some documentation that you are wishing to come through for you to sign it to make everything um, official you know um, some of you could be thinking of getting a property um, something of that sort with this guy here with this page of sword here but I also feel like it's an information which will help your business to become successful and so this is this is what is affecting your environment okay so you watch out for anyone who is a water sign or air sign or documentation or you know if you're into the law of attraction yes you know you can also go ahead with that with the nine of cups but i also feel like this is something you also wish for and this can happen for you all you need is sheer determination yeah so your hopes and fears is possibly traveling <laughs> yes but then as we can see this is a this is a travel card and this guy here the card crossing you the ten of one is busy so if you are concerned that you'll be traveling yes you will be traveling you you certainly will be traveling to places you know it's going to be a busy month for you that is how i see this guy it's going to be busy definitely busy yes you've got a 10 here i mean this is one of the busiest cards in terms of business type of stuff and this guy here he's traveling all over the place this can this also you know symbolize a travel card so yes so if you are concerned and it's your hopes and fears please just go ahead with it because you are nearly there okay you are nearly there you are going to travel okay and i feel like eventually you are going to feel content you will be feeling content looking at this queen of cup here because why wouldn't you be hmm? look at that this was can, what can be achieved this is what is coming this is your outcome does this look bad to you, Aries? No, it doesn't look bad at all. This looks really, really good. Yes? So, outcome, 
what can be achieved, what is coming. Success, happiness, fulfillment. What what don't I like about this reading? <laughs> Everything is spot on in the sense that I'm happy with all that. Okay? You can't be happier than this. The sun can, I mean, you can't, you cannot complain. You know, I feel if this was my personal reading, I'd love it. So, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, yes. And, and I had to show you this. The base is your five of cups, which also shows that you are concerned. You know, you are worried about traveling. But yes, you have to travel, you know, leaving the comfort of your home um, to, to, to get the job done. But you have to, okay, Aries, you have to. Um, don't, don't, don't feel like, oh, I don't want to go because life is so comfortable at home. No, it's something you've been thinking of and you want to get it done. Yes. So you are nearly there. It's going to be a busy, busy month. Just get on with it. Okay. Get on with it. And you are going to be successful. Okay, cool. So thank you, Aries, for your time. And um, I hope this has been insightful for you. I have enjoyed your reading for this month. And I hope you have too. And yes, I'll be seeing you next month. Or you'll be seeing me next month. Or you can check my other channel. Which I'll be uploading some interesting pick a card reading soon. So thank you for your time, Aries. <laughs>